a pretty girl. I'll wear a skirt for you. Today we're gonna be talking about the indie queen slash lo-fi queen, aka everyone's woman crush Wednesday, DJ Baby Benz, aka Claro, or also known as Claire Elizabeth Cottrell. Well known for her songs like Pretty Girl, Forever, and Sophia, which are all bangers if I do say so myself. Claire was born in Atlanta, Georgia around 1998 and grew up in Massachusetts. She comes from very wealthy parents, which led her down to many controversies that she's an industry plant, and her upbringings was brought by her parents, specifically her father. Claro's first ever success and fame will be in 2017, in which the music video of her first song, Pretty Girl, will blow up. The song will be so big that both boys and girls will be enjoying the song. You will most likely hear a boy play this song than a girl. After her viral success with Pretty Girl, she would later sign with the Fader label. Don't get me wrong, Claire was no one hit wonder and Pretty Girl isn't her only song. She had plenty of songs before Pretty Girl was released like Bubblegum, Sis, Edith, and Flaming Hot Cheetos. She probably has a lot more songs in her vault that she hasn't released yet. Anyway, after being signed with the Fader, she would release a music video with them for the song Flaming Hot Cheetos which will include cameos from Kuko, Interwave, Zach Villery and Michael Sayer. After that, she will release her first EP, which will be called Diary 001. This EP will include popular tracks like Pretty Girl, Flaming Hot Cheetos, but also new tracks like Hello and Forever. She released this EP to show off her skills and then want to be only known for her song Pretty Girl. Either way, this EP will only have six songs in total. After her success with her first EP and fame, people will claim that Clara was an industry plant and was facing a lot of backlash because the viral song that blew up Claro, which was Pretty Girl, might have been a ripped off version of a song called None Lover, which was made by Charlotte Ercoli. Either way, Claro didn't let this affect her that much and kept on going with her career. In 2019, she will release her very first album, not an EP, an album which will be called Immunity, which will be an 11-track album. She will hype up this album by dropping the bangers like Bags, Closer to You, and Sophia. The only other song that will stand out for this album will be Softly, in my opinion. The influence for the album title will be because of an arthritis disease she got diagnosed with. But on the positive note, this album was a way for her to release her intense feelings about her age and feelings for women because she will later come out as bi on Twitter. And to close off this video, all I want to say is happy late birthday, Clara, and I hope you had a wonderful birthday.